Hey guys, it's Vera Sweeney from Lady in the Blog, and I'm going to show you how to make um, really easy artichokes. So I have the majority of them prepped, but I just want to show you. Get your bread knife or your serrated knife and chop off the bottom part because you want to get rid of the stem. And pull off any loose leaves. And then you want to pull off, you want to cut off the top as well because that's unedible as it is. And plus we want to be sure that we can close the top of our pan. Now we're going to put garlic and parsley in, so it's really important to open up the leaves before we put it inside. So just get your fingers in there and open it up. I've already chopped one clove per, um, per artichoke and just a bunch of parsley. Now come on over to the pan and I'm going to show you uh, what we're going to do. So what I like to do is I just like to lay them, I'm actually going to have to do this in two batches because I'm going to a friend's house and um, there's a whole bunch of us going. So I can only fit so many in my pan. So I fill the pan with um, half water. I can only fit five artichokes in my pan and then I just drizzle some extra virgin olive oil over the top. I know you're going to ask me for a measurement. I don't have a measurement to give you, I'm sorry. You then are going to just take a handful of garlic and stuff it into the leaves of your artichoke. Just get it in there. The more the merrier. And this is raw garlic, of course. It'll cook with the steam of the water. Push it down. A little or as, li or as much as you want, entirely up to you. Uh, the parsley will melt and wither, you know, wither in. Okay, so there is my parsley. You're going to take some salt and pepper and sprinkle it on top. And this also seasons the water. So that was my salt. And then here's my pepper. Now this is this is sort of a rolling boil. We don't want to keep it that high. We want to close the lid and bring it down to a low medium and let it go for about 20 minutes. And in 20 minutes I'll show you what we end up with. All right, so I know that I said 20 minutes in the beginning of this tape, but I gave it, I opened it up and I tasted it and it really needed a little bit more time. So uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna say 45 minutes on um, medium. So uh, go medium, top on the whole entire time, and, and give it a good 45 minutes to, to really give it that softening uh, that you're looking for when you're, when you're going for the artichoke leaf. We're gonna open it up. This is what we look like once we're done. So as you can see, they've opened up a bit. Um, the leaves are nice and um, soft. When you pull them out, I like to, go sideways a little bit to get some of the water to come out. So the exterior leaves will fall off and that's okay. Use tongs. To me this is the easiest way to do it. Squeeze them out. I'm putting them in a pan only because um, I'm going to my friend's house and I need something to transfer. Some parsley will fall out, no big deal. So just take a look to see what it looks like once it's in the pan. Nice and beautiful. And oh, so good. Um, if you want, you can drizzle a little more olive oil on the top, but to me these look pretty good. Uh, if you want, just do a little bit, a very light drizzle on the top before you serve. And try to serve 
immediately. They're, they're best when they're served immediately. And you know, the leaves come off and you'll see some garlic and parsley in each of them. They won't be in every leaf, but they will be in the majority of them. And I'm gonna sneak a little one since I made them. Mm -mm -mm. It's my favorite because while I love stuffed artichokes, lots of calories and it's too filling for an everyday meal. Garlic and parsley is perfect for your family dinners, for parties. I'm going to a potluck. This is something that everyone can enjoy and it's super easy to make. So that's it and um, until next time.